The November 1937 issue of Poetry Magazine published a poem entitled For My People by a then 22-year-old poet named Margaret Walker. Her poem addresses the experiences, struggles, and impending triumphs of African Americans, or to use Walker's phrase, my people. In 1942, Walker won the Yale series of Younger Poets, and her collection of poems was published as For My People. The most known poem in the volume was, of course, For My People. In 1954, the Smithsonian released an album entitled Anthology of Negro Poetry, which featured poets Langston Hughes, Claude McKay, Gwendolyn Brooks, Sterling Brown, County Cullen, and Margaret Walker reading their poems. Walker's contributions included her reading for my people. During the 1960s and 1970s, publishers released an unprecedented number of literature anthologies showcasing black poetry. Editors of the collections regularly chose to reprint For My People. Between 1967 and 1974 alone, Walker's poem appeared in more than 20 anthologies. In 1975, the Smithsonian released an album, The Poetry of Margaret Walker, which featured Walker reading For My People, along with several of her other poems. In subsequent years and then decades, anthology editors began to regularly reprint For My People, making Walker's poem one of the most anthologized poems in African-American literary history. In a reading of the poem late in her life, Walker noted that, quote, This is my supposedly, my signature poem that everybody knows. When you say this poem, you say Margaret Walker. When you say Margaret Walker, you say, for my people.